Hi guys, welcome to Cook with Shafali. Today I'm making cream rolls. Cream roll is one of my favorite childhood memories and for my love for cream roll, I want to share this recipe with you. So let's go ahead and see how to make cream rolls super easy, super fast. I'll share some tips and tricks with you so we can get it perfect every time. To make cream horns, you need these puff pastry sheets that you can find in the frozen aisle in most grocery stores. Now I would not recommend making these cause it could be cumbersome. So we will use these frozen sheets and let them thaw as per the box directions, which is 40 minutes. To shape the cream horns or cream rolls, we need some kind of molds. These ones are available online or we can make them ourselves using aluminum foil. Now based on your preference, you can either make a pipe shape which will give you cream roll or a cone shape which will give you cream horns. I would recommend making a cone shape as it pops out after baking very easily. Now line your baking sheet with the parchment paper and grease your mold with melted butter. Once your sheet is thawed, preheat your oven at 360 degrees Fahrenheit. These sheets are a little too small and thick to make cream horns, so we will stretch them to make them about half of their thickness. I am stretching these about 50% lengthwise and about 10% widthwise. Now cut this sheet into about 1 inch wide strips and then roll it around the mold. Now let's see it one more time. To make the cream horns look even, I am overlapping the strips onto each other halfway and then I will tuck the end really well and face it down on the baking tray. Now before popping them in the oven, we will give them an egg wash or a milk wash and sprinkle a little sugar onto them. This will add a glaze and a beautiful color after baking. Now while these bake, let's make a heavy cream filling. Make sure to chill your bowl and whisk in the refrigerator beforehand. This really helps with whipping the cream well. Go slow as the cream starts to get thick and stop when it's able to hold its shape and form stiff peaks. Now fill your cream in a piping bag or a Ziploc bag. Here I'm using tip number 199 but using a tip is not really necessary. When the cream horns and cream rolls are baked, then I take them out and let them cool down to room temperature. I think I really like these DIY cone shapes that we made. They come out really easily as compared to the pipe shapes that we made for the cream rolls. Now a little extra treat for the kids, I'll coat these with chocolate and their favorite sprinkles. Use any chocolate that you like, to melt it put in the microwave for 30 seconds and to set it, refrigerate it for half an hour. If you like Nutella, then fill a little at the bottom before filling in the heavy cream. I personally like them without any chocolate, just good old fashioned heavy cream. Now to finish these up, just sprinkle a little powdered sugar. And there you go, delicious cream horns are ready to eat. So I hope you liked and you enjoyed watching this video and um, I appreciate if you like and subscribe and uh, let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thank you.